Czech Prime Minister Petr Fiala recently visited the Philippines as part of his state visit from April 16 to 18, 2023. As the first leg of his 10-day tour across Asia that involves other countries like Vietnam, Indonesia, and Uzbekistan. As part of his efforts to bolster ties with the said countries as the Czechs are creating a counterbalance to China's dominance in terms of trade, where it has a huge market share, attempting to reduce reliance on this Asian regional giant. In the Philippines, the Czech Prime Minister said that his country considers delivering air assets for the Philippine Coast Guard to use, which can be considered an interesting development within the agency. He also opened up opportunities for the Philippines to acquire the much-needed Let L-410 Ng aircraft for the Philippine Coast Guard. Coming alongside other updates related to the Maritime Law Enforcement Agency, such as their proposals to add more Teresa Magbanua-class multirole response vessels on top of the two vessels of that type already active in Philippine Coast Guard service. To sum it up, the Let L-410 Ng aircraft presents an opportunity to improve ties between the Philippines and the Czech Republic as a form of ever-increasing cooperation. In the essence that it provides the Philippine Coast Guard it needs while having the potential to improve other areas of bilateral relations, such as defense, whereby the Czechs provide military hardware in the country, such as the Pander 26x6 armored vehicles for the wheeled variant of the Sabre tank and Tatra trucks that carry Spider GBADS platforms. Like any other light aircraft, the Let L-410 Ng is capable of takeoff and landing on small runways, whereby it only requires at least 590 meters and 600 meters of runway, respectively, to get its job done. This is essential as areas like the runway on Pag Asa Island and the Kalayan Island Group only have a limited runway length to accommodate aircraft, serving troops, and civilians on the island west of Palawan. In comparison, the North Carolina 212i aircraft comes with both takeoff and landing distance requirements of 740 meters and 527 meters, respectively. Another aspect of the Let L-410 Ng aircraft to focus on is its overall dimension and size regarding its length, width, and height, whereby its overall length comes in at 49.46 feet. Its wingspan, or overall width, is 63.90 feet and its height from the landing gear to the tip of its tail is around 19.58 feet. As we convert them to the metric system, this means that the aircraft has an overall length of 15.08 meters, a wingspan of 19.48 meters, and a height from the landing gear to the tip of its tail of around 5.98 meters. Comparing this to the Philippine Army's South Dakota 3-30, Sherpa transport aircraft as used by its Army Aviation Haraya, Regiment, the Let L-410 Ng that the Czechs are offering to the Philippine Coast Guard comes smaller, as the Sherpa comes longer at around 17.70 meters and has a wingspan of 22.80 meters. Although the L-410 Ng aircraft comes taller as the Sherpa only comes with around 5 meters from its landing gear up to the tail. Sherpa's size also comes with its capability to carry more passengers on board than the Let L-410 NG, with a maximum of 30 people on board for the Sherpa 330 variant. Completing the aircraft specifications are the engines currently fitted on board the Let L-410 Ng aircraft, where it comes with a GEH-85-200 engine a General Electric certified product that is currently manufactured by General Electric Aviation Czech Division, with turboprop engines being their primary production focus. The turboprop engines have a rate of 850 shaft horsepower, SHP, less than the Honeywell TPE 331-12 Junior 701C. Turboprop engines power the North Carolina 212i of the Philippine Air Force and the variants of Pratt & Whitney turboprops that run the Sherpa aircraft of the Philippine Army.